When I was first applying to residency programs, I really wanted somewhere where I would be challenged on a daily basis. I wanted a lot of clinical exposure, in the OR especially. I knew, knowing myself, I knew that to be the surgeon I wanted to be, I just needed a lot of repetition from more sort of bread and butter skills in neurosurgery all the way up to the most complex techniques. Mount Sinai's Department of Neurosurgery is one of the largest and busiest neurosurgery programs in the country. We've recruited some of the nation's leading neurosurgeons and research scientists who are globally recognized for their ability to take on the most complex brain and spine cases. The Mount Sinai Neurosurgery Residency Program stands above its peers as a preeminent neurosurgical training program. The Department of Neurosurgery is the largest in New York City with a comprehensive breadth of subspecialty cases. At Sinai, our residents come from a diverse, talented background. They are smart, innovative, energetic, and compassionate. We believe that these traits not only help make for a talented neurosurgeon, but also a committed physician. A lot of what drew me to Mount Sinai, at least initially when I was looking, was the reputation of a really clinically strong neurosurgery training program. I wanted to go somewhere where I knew I would come out a fantastic and experienced, you know, technical neurosurgeon at the end of my seven years. Uh, and Sinai certainly had that reputation. One of the advantages of being a resident at the Mount Sinai Health System is the wide array of neurosurgical cases you're exposed to throughout your years of residency. As an intern and as a chief, we rotate at Elmhurst Hospital, which is our New York City public hospital. It's also our level one trauma center. During your junior years, you rotate at Mount Sinai Hospital, where you see some of the most complex cases in neurosurgery. During your middle years of residency, you rotate at Mount Sinai West, which is our specialty center for intracerebral hemorrhage, for epilepsy surgery, for functional neurosurgery, as well as pediatrics. The research resources here are really unprecedented. Residents can really get a large amount of high quality clinical research done here um, because they have a massive team of clinical research uh, individuals to tap into. Uh, these are professional researchers who are doing all the aspects of clinical and translational research uh, that take time and require actual uh, specialty knowledge to get done at a high level. We encourage our residents to focus on areas in the field they feel especially passionate about. During your academic enrichment year, whether within or outside Mount Sinai, residents will participate and explore their specific interests with protected time, freedom, and support. Living in New York City is great. I really enjoy it. There are great things about New York City. There's always something to do. It's always a place open if you need to get something to eat. In terms of the clinical training, New York is, is huge. And so you're gonna see everything, every sort of pathology that you could ever imagine you're gonna see here. Um, and most likely multiple times um, throughout your residency. As a former resident here, I've witnessed remarkable growth, development, and innovation. We have had a legacy of training outstanding alumni who've been national leaders, not only for their research, but for their clinical innovation. One of the things that drew me to doing neurosurgery residency here at Mount Sinai was the culture of our residents. It's really the people here that make the difference. There were a lot of like-minded residents. Everyone really cares about each other. It truly is more of a family dynamic than a resident cohort. We look forward to welcoming you our new Mount Sinai Neurosurgery residents to the beginning of your amazing clinical and academic career in neurosurgery. Mount Sinai, I think, is the best place to train. Um, we have everything that you could want in a program. We operate every day. Uh, we operate on tumors, aneurysms, we do functional, we do spine. Anything that you can imagine, we're tackling those cases in the operating room, and we have interesting research projects outside the operating room. So this is the place you want to be.